Okay, so I've got my uh, trench dug. I've got the pipe laying in there. Before I go too far and uh, bury too much of the pipe, I want to actually get my uh, feeder cable through there, or at least a piece of rope so I can pull it through, just to make sure I'm not going to have any issues uh, getting the cable through there before I bury it and make it impossible to get to. So there's a neat little trick for uh, getting cable through. What you need is a thin piece of string, a uh, bit of paper on the end, that's just uh, standard toilet paper, and then uh, the pipe comes up in this little box here. So what I'm going to do is I've got a hoover, standard domestic hoover. I'm going to connect that onto the end of the pipe. Got a generator down here to power the hoover. And then I'm going to go down the other end and drop this down the other end and hopefully uh, suck it all the way through until it comes out this end. That's the theory. Let's uh, give it a go and uh, see what happens. All right, let's get this generator started. There we go. Right, Hoover's on, pipe's in there nice and secure. Now down the other end and uh, I'm just going to, uh, yeah there's definitely a vacuum there. Right, put my uh, piece of uh, string down there. Seems to be working a treat this. The only thing is, I don't know how long this piece of string is. I'll tell a lie, I know the string's 100 metres long and it's a 50 metre run. Uh, what I meant is I'm not going to know um, when we've reached 50 metres and when we're into the hoover. Keep going until we get about half of the roll out, I guess. Yeah. There you go, works a treat. Oh dear, I put a bit more through than I really needed to. Put a lot more through than I really needed to actually. Okay, so what I've done now then is I've pulled the uh, string tight, taken all the uh, slack out of the string, and I've done what I should have done with the string, which is uh, measured out the length of my uh, feeder cable to the uh, ditch in the ground to make sure that it wasn't too long or too short. So I have actually measured the feeder cable this time. I've uh, taped it on to uh, the end of my bit of string there and I'm going to uh, poke it down inside the pipe which comes up inside this box and then in theory when I go and pull on the string the other end it should pull my uh, feeder cable through or well that's the theory anyway let's give it a go right so we're down at the other end then where my uh, string and my uh, feeder cable is going to come out the ground there's the pipe there and all I'm going to do is just keep pulling the string and hopefully, I'm looking at my feeder cable over there. I'm hoping my feeder cable is going to come through. Though that could be famous last words. Something not right there. Right, so it's a couple of days later and you probably figured out that didn't go quite as well as I'd hoped. Um, we ended up uh, doing away with the cameras in the end, a number of reasons. I only had a uh, limited amount of time. I only had the JCB for another couple of hours to fill in the uh, ditch after that. So uh, I just had to get on, get the job done and uh, film it later. So hence why there's no footage of that. But uh, I did manage to get the uh, feeder cable through the pipe. Um, it was a lot stiffer than I thought. I had to put a, uh, I actually broke the string. So I had to put a thicker, tougher string through and then uh, pull that through and then pull the uh, feeder cable through on that. So uh, it took a bit longer than expected and uh, got the JCB and uh, filled in all the trench here all the way back to the feed point way down the other end. So the next thing we need to do now is put in our ground and radial system. So. Uh Thank you for watching. If you like what I do, please click the thumbs up button. 
It lets me know that I'm heading in the right direction with the channel and gives me the confidence to keep doing what I'm doing. Don't forget to click the subscribe and also the bell button to be notified when I upload new content. If you don't like what I'm doing, feel free to click the thumbs down button. Just tell me why in the comments below. I welcome your feedback and constructive criticism will help me to improve the channel. Take care and I hope you will catch me in the next video.